Good evening, my viewers at home. Well, welcome to our channel, New Life. We are here to where we used to teach ourselves what we can use our hand to do for the benefit of our heads and our life generally. And like I used to say, if you are watching us for the first time, try to subscribe to the, this channel. Press the notify bell to notify you whenever you drop a new video. And try to share it with your family and friends on social media. Try to share it on Instagram and Facebook and WhatsApp for the benefit of order to gain from it. And don't forget to request for whatever you wanted us to treat that we've not mentioned or for the one that I've treated and it's not clear to you. Comment we will respond to your question instantly. Like today's program is a request from one of our subscribers and he asked for the solution. Although we asked the question back and he has not responded, but let's treat it today for unhealing wound. Unhealing wound. Unhealing wound is differently. There are some wounds that is affecting us traditionally that they may use it as a bad omen in someone's life. That is what. Two, there must be there more there there are some one that is wound because of the diabetes and it is not it may not heal. That's another one. But if you are expressed or really wound that you know you are not having diabetes. This is one of the best simple solution that you will apply to it and the something will change and it will be healing. The wound will be healing gradually. If you have a healing wound that you know that you are not having diabetes, because with diabetes you firstly need to treat diabetes before you can treat wound. But a healing wound that you know you are not having diabetes, this is one of the best solution you can apply to it. Try to get pseudo apple leaf. Pseudo apple leaf. They call it in Yoruba a way bomu bomu. Only that you will get the solution to what you want. That pseudo apple leaf, put it on your granny stone. I think you can get as many as the little you want. Grant it very well. You can apply a little water, just small water, to make it, you know, you see, it will still what you got. Just to give you a little water or something. Or you may not apply the water. Just grant whatever you get very well. Put it in somewhere. Or if it's not far to you, you can get it. You can be doing it daily, on a daily basis. If you know you can get it as fresh and be grinding and apply it to it. That what you grant. Apply it on that wound that the person has. After I apply it on the wound, on that faithful day, leave it. Let it seal up. In the second day, try to do another one. If that is the way you like it, apply it in that wound. Before you do it for two weeks, I swear to Almighty God that created you. I bet it with you. You will see changes on your wound. That unhealing wound will be gradually healing. It will be healing gradually and you will see improvement changes that you will have overcome or really won. By God's grace, the, the sickness that will not get solution will not do us. By doing this, try to be doing it every day. That if that is the comfortable and best way for you, and you can get the Sodom go Sodom Sodom Apple Leaf. Uh, regarding it and applying it to it every day. After you wash it, you wash the wound and do the work I ask you to do, apply it, uh, apply it to it. By God's grace, you will experience the miraculous changes in that unhealing wound. So like you know, we used to tell you that we used to do it in English and Yoruba. Let's go for the Yoruba segment. So I think you can see that 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 you can see that